Hi, I'm Scott Boswell at Stella Restaurant. We'd like to welcome you to our kitchen. And today we're going to be doing a very popular dish on our menu. It's called Iron Chef Chili Prawns, New Orleans style. It's a very simple dish uh, featuring local ingredients with lots of international flair, lots of different parts of Asia. We have Korean, we have Japanese, French, Italian, Creole, Vietnamese. It's all what we do here at Stella today. But it's actually as complicated as it sounds, it's a very simple recipe, and I'm going to show you how to do it right now. We start off with, these are beautiful, I mean, this is one of the most beautiful ingredients, I think, in Louisiana, it's from the Gulf of Mexico, it's the white shrimp, and uh, we have several here, we're only going to be using three today, and these are our seven ingredients, which the dish is compound of, is salt and pepper, we season the shrimp with, and then we'll use a generous amount of garlic, and then white wine. This is a Korean chili flakes. That's going to be more of the chili flavor because they're very mild. Uh, we have scallions, which is just the green onion tops also. We have plain white sugar. And this is a sriracha, which is a Vietnamese chili paste. That's where the heat's going to come from. Also flavor, but it's also much, much hotter than the uh, Korean chili flakes. And then we have whole unsalted butter. So those are all the ingredients. We like to take these shrimp and you can you can clean them all the way down, you can take the head off and the tail off, but for presentation purposes, and also for flavor purposes, I mean the head probably has some of the most flavor of the shrimp of all, I mean that's where we make the stocks from, and the shell itself has very little input to those stocks you make, but the head is just packed with so much delicious flavor, and it also looks good on the plate. We also want to take a knife and just gently go down, not too deep, open it up so we can take that vein out. Which is, uh, I mean, you could eat it if you wanted to, but uh, you know what that is. So, anyway, we take three shrimp, which have been cleaned, deveined, just put head and tail on. We take a hot saute pan. We're going to add olive oil. I use extra virgin. I mean, you can use butter, you can use regular oil, you can use canola oil. Um, I just like the flavor of olive oil. very hot, it's already starting to smoke. We're going to take our salt and pepper, season both sides of the shrimp, and go directly to the pan. It's a very quick process. I don't want to overcook the shrimp. It's nothing worse than overcooked the shrimp. Turn it. Let's see a little color. I'm going to come in with a generous amount of garlic. Probably about two tablespoons of chopped garlic. You want that to brown light, but not dark brown. You don't want it bitter. That nice aroma. This dish is really a big seller on the menu. This is exactly how we make it in the restaurant. It's cooked to order. We get a little color. We're going to come in with about probably half a cup of white wine, Chardonnay, Chablis, whatever you want. You don't really need too sweet of a white wine because we're going to add sugar to it. But if you do use a sweet wine, maybe you can use less sugar. There's so many variables that go into this recipe. We use a dry Chablis. White wine goes in, and then we have our Korean chili flakes. We're going to put them in right now so they put it dry. They can kind of cook in that white wine. Now the, cook, the shrimp will start to cook very quickly now because we have put in white wine and steam, as we know, is very, very hot. So the cooking process now is almost over. We'll just turn the shrimp, coating them in the chili flakes. That to the side, and we're going to take a piece of, this is a French type bread, we bake it here in the restaurant, you can use any kind of bread, the purpose of the bread on this plate is the sauce is so, so darn amazing that they, we need something on the bottom to soak all that up, because there's no way you can spoon it all up, and it's a nice piece of absorbent bread, it's going to absorb that sauce, and honestly it's kind of my favorite part of the dish, even though the shrimp are featured, it's a nice slice of bread, 
again a little olive oil. We're just going to put this up in the salamander. We're going to give it a nice little golden brown. Put back on here. I'm going to add a little bit more white wine. Coming in with scallions now. Generous amount. A little bit of sugar. Just to kind of sweeten up the salt and heat. This is the, the Vietnamese sriracha. Not too much of this. This could really change it too much if you add too much. It's more just to add the heat element. Then we're going to come in with whole butter. This is where the French technique comes in. Au Monte au Beurre. So a lot of global <laughs> globe trotting going on here in one pan. That's kind of what we do at Stella. That's um, the magic of what our food is. It's not really. It's not really Asian, it's not really this or that, it's, uh, it's still a food. Now to plate this dish up, we take the bread, which is nice and brown, put it on the plate. And we come over, one shrimp that way, one shrimp that way. Geometry going on, a lot of angles, boom, 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 boom. Look at that magic sauce. I mean, wow. All this you're going on, this is a little bit much, but pull that right over there. Okay. Finish the dish off with some scallions on top. There you have it, one of our signature dishes, Iron Chef Chili Prawns, New Orleans style, Stella Restaurant. Thank you.